Hi guys and welcome to week 7 of the Puppy Diaries on Working With It TV. In this week I'm just going to go over how we get the pups jumping small obstacles before they even go to their owns. As you can see it's just a short video and you get the gist of it and then the owners can take it from there when they've got the pups. Here you can see the pups are uh, coming through the gateway to have a run on the grass. I've just put up a small obstacle. Um, as you see pups jump it with ease at 7 weeks old and we don't really want anything too hard and too taxing for them. Now we've just hired the jump up a little bit and again the pups are clearing it with ease at 7 weeks old. I'll keep this like this for a while, well I'd, I'd suggest owners keep it at this height for a while and slowly progress the boards up and up and up and up. As the pup gets older, 5 months, 6 months, 7 months old, I'd go on to this sort of builder's fencing and the road pins, you can put it at different heights in the ground and if a pup hits it, it really doesn't hurt it. Once your pup then gets confident at jumping again, 8, 9, 10 months old, I'd move on to this stuff here, the rabbit netting, but with no strands of wire on top, no barbed wire or, or eye tensile wire on top at all. Then, as the pup gets older again, move on to the five bar gate. And the biggest one for me, which is essential when lamping, is to get a pup to jump the sheep netting with two strands of barbed wire on top. The, the dog needs to be doing this for lamping. When you've got your hands full of lamps and batteries and rabbits, you really don't want to be picking the dog up. So guys, that concludes a short video on jumping. As you can see, it's all simple stuff. It's just about steady progression from the small obstacles up to things you'll encounter in the field. It's also a good idea to teach the pups to manoeuvre around, under and through obstacles as well as jumping. So keep that in mind when you're training your pups. If you like the videos, subscribe, hit the like button, we appreciate it. And if you're on Twitter, follow us at Working With Pets.